Hi, this is Jay Harris with Infinity Box. In this video, I want to talk about our in-motion motor controller cell. In previous videos, we've talked about our master cell, which connects to all of your switches. We've also talked about our power cells that take commands from the master cells and turn things on and off in your car. And those things could be things like your fuel pump, or your cooling fan, or your headlights. The power cell turns things on and off. But there's a lot of things in your car that need more than on and off. They have to have the polarity reversed to make something happen. So for example, your power windows. In your power windows, there's a motor that spins one direction to raise the window, and then the current flowing to that motor has to be reversed, so the motor will spin the other direction so the window will go down. And historically, that current reversing has been managed inside the switch that runs the windows up or down. The same thing is true for power locks. There's an actuator in the car that when current flows one direction, the door is locked. The switch reverses current flowing to that actuator and that unlocks the door. Or you may have a linear actuator that you want to use to raise and lower a hood or a trunk, or you maybe even have exhaust cutouts where the motor for the exhaust cutouts has to be reversed to open and close the exhaust gate. So that's where our in-motion cell comes in. The power cell has 10 outputs that turn on and off. In-motion has five pairs that reverse polarity. So you would wire your power windows or your power locks or a linear actuator right here to the in-motion cell. And in-motion would control that. Just like the power cell, you're going to connect any switch to the master cell. That switch, when it closes, the master cell sees that and sends a command to in motion to raise and lower a window or lock and unlock the doors. You don't have to use a special polarity reversing switch to control your windows or your locks with in motion. Any switch will do that. You can also use our in link key fob. Pressing buttons on the key fob can lock and unlock your doors when you enable or disable security. You can also do that from our in touch net. So by pushing buttons on the in touch net screens, you can raise and lower your windows or lock and unlock your doors. Now, in motion is smarter than a power cell because it actually watches how much current flows out to the window or the lock or the linear actuator. There are special sensors inside here that monitor that current. And by monitoring the current, that lets us do a lot more. Specifically, it gets us express functions. So what I can do is I can just tap the down button for my windows. In motion is going to drive that window down. When the window hits the bottom, where it hits a mechanical stop, the current to that motor goes up very quickly. In motion detects that increase in current and shuts it off. So again, what that means is I can just tap the down button for my driver's window. In motion is going to express that window down. Once it hits the bottom, it detects that and immediately shuts it off. So again, a lot more flexibility and more OEM-like functions in whatever your classic car is. I can also set it so I can push a button on my in-link key fob. When I press that button, the master cell receives it and tells in motion to express all my windows down. Let's say it's a hot day and I'm walking up to the car and I want to ventilate it before I get there. Or I can do the same thing from InTouchNet. So from my phone, I can press a button and express all my windows down. The in-motion cell uses the exact same construction, the exact same bolt pattern as our master cell and our power cell. So very rugged, high durability materials all sealed connectors, and the entire cell has all the fuses inside it to protect the wires that go out to the windows and locks and anything, you, anything else you may be controlling. In motion is sold as a package kit, and in that kit you get the in motion cell, you get the primary fuses that protect the power and ground feed wires that go to in motion, you get the output harnesses that go from in motion to the things you're controlling, you get the CAN cable that connects in motion to the rest of your network, and you get all the ring terminals and fuses that you need to make it a complete kit. So that's our in motion cell. If you have any questions, you can reach out to our technical team at 847 232 1991 or check out our website at www.infinitybox.com. If you like these videos, please subscribe and hit the bell icon so you get notified when we post more. Take care and thanks for watching.